off the clock and rewind. Go back to that moment in time. Hi, YouTube. I hope all is well. TGIF, it's the weekend, everybody. What I'm going to be doing is, it's my friend's birthday. She's a Leo, I'm a Virgo. So it's her birthday and we're gonna be celebrating in Orlando. So guys, I'm gonna take you guys with me. So we're supposed to be going to this place called the H in Orlando. It's a nice restaurant and then it's a, like a, a club um, after effect. So I'm excited about going. Right now I am cooking lunch. I was supposed to go get my feet done, but I don't think I'm gonna have time to go get my feet done because I have some things that I need to do with my business. So ladies, so how about this? I got my nails done. Look at my nails. These are my real nails. They are growing so long. Yes, I have on my little, I think um, in the video where I had the car thing, I had on a pink pair of shorts like this. So here are the jeans that similar to it. Now, I bought these shorts a while back. I like them. I like them a lot. Kind of make me feel like a cowgirl, y'all. <laughs> I don't know what I'm planning on wearing tonight, but it's going to be something really cute. Um, I thought about maybe a dress. I don't know yet. I don't know. A dress and some heels. So Orlando is probably about a two-hour drive for us. So we're basically going to go enjoy and come back. We're not staying. So anyways, guys, I hope you all are enjoying your weekend so far. It's been really, really hot here lately. It's just like super hot. I have a beautiful tan, guys, and I'm loving it. I'm loving my, my tan. I think it's cute. So I know you guys see my hair. My natural hair when I was born was not much different from this color when i was born my hair was actually a little bit darker than this but it was on it was reddish tones um and i started dyeing my hair when i got out of high school well actually before then i started putting black dyes and colors and stuff in my hair and my hair changed colors i think i probably was maybe in middle school or something like that when i had started using rinses and stuff like that but anyways, I feel like I hurt my finger here. Yeah, so I'm kind of getting ready for the holidays pretty early. And that's something that I have to do because as I stated, I do have a birthday in next month in September. So if you all want to help me celebrate my birthday, I'll put my cash app down below and you guys can help me celebrate my birthday. How about that? <laughs> so um, yeah, and I'm serious. So anyways, guys, I was thinking around the holidays, I do want to do Vlogmas. I tried to do Vlogmas for the first time last year, and I wasn't very successful. I think I made it through all but maybe a week. I couldn't do it. It was just so much going on. And with me doing open enrollment, it was really difficult for me to work and then do the videos. But I'm going to prepare myself. You could do anything if you prepare yourself. So I'm going to prepare myself for it this time and I'm going to be ready, ready, ready. So what I'm going to be doing also is starting next week, I am going to start doing a detox type of thing. It's not really a diet. It's pretty much a detox with pineapple and cucumbers. I'm going to do those drinks and just see what happens with that. I haven't really gained a lot, a lot of weight back, but I did lose weight like probably two months ago. And I got down pretty good, so I'm starting to pick it back up again. And that comes from me eating sugary stuff. I have this thing about sweets, desserts, and things like that, and I'm going to have to cut it out because it's just it's getting too extreme. And I did want strawberry cake the other day, so I did bake a strawberry cake. I made some little cupcakes out of it and then just a little small cake. So I've been like nibbling off of it every morning. I'll wake up and have a cup of coffee and get like a little slice. But that's all I'll eat and some fruit maybe. So that's, that's pretty much it. I don't think that's too bad. But I'm going to have to end up, I'm afraid, throwing some of it away because it's just a lot. I don't want to sit here and say, it just don't sound right saying, hey, I ate a whole cake, you know? 
you guys know what I'm talking about. Guys, I'm gonna catch you guys on the road. Like I said, my friend Danielle, it's her birthday and happy birthday, Danny. So we're supposed to be leaving out again about six. Hopefully it'll be a good place for fun. I did go online and I checked it out to see if it was, you know, how it was and everything. Of course you wanna know the dress code and everything. And so I did check it out and everything seemed to be pretty cool. So yeah, yeah, I'm feeling this red on me, y'all. <laughs> I'm really feeling this. I might stick with this color for a minute. So yeah, so I'm gonna catch you guys in a bit. See you in a bit. Yes, yes, so this is my turkey burger, guys. I don't use full bread. I use a little flat bread to make my burger. And I have, of course, lettuce and tomatoes. And then I'm gonna cook my fries. Not only is it less costly when you cook at home, it's you also you know what you're putting in your food. So here is my lunch, guys. I'm really feeling this root beer, zero sugar root beer. And let's look at the calories on the back. Zero calories. It's 5% sodium. I do drink these from time to time because guess what? Because sometimes I do want a soda. I drink water most of the time, but then I drink a, a zero, and this is no caffeine. I drink my coffee in the morning as my caffeine, and so that's pretty much it. Lunch bunch, guys. Hi, YouTube. So I am dressed, and I am ready to go. So this is what I decided to wear. I change clothes a couple of times. I'm always wearing black. I'm trying to get out of wearing black, but I can't. It's difficult. I had a pantsuit and I took it off. It wasn't black. It was a different color, like white with other colors in it. But I decided to go this route. Since we'll be riding for a couple of hours, I wanted to put on something that was comfortable. And this is comfortable for me. I do have on my shoes. So I am going to be wearing heels and these heels are a little bit wide, so I don't have to worry about, oh, I don't have support in them, because of course, yes, I may be standing. It does have etching on the sides. I bought these shoes from Macy's in the mall a while back. I like them. They're comfy and everything. And so you can never go wrong with your little black dress, so I decided to wear this. And I noticed that I'm always wearing black. I just gotta really get out of that. So I'm waiting for my friend to come. She's supposed to come scoop me up, but she did call me and she was like, well, what time are we leaving? First of all, I'm gonna tell you, that girl, it takes her forever to get dressed. It's like, she's always running late. Even when she's on time, she's late. It's like, oh, I didn't do this, I gotta do this. She's gonna dash up in here, run in the bathroom and try to put on her makeup when we're already running late. And so we do have reservations. And in some of the restaurants, you know, if you guys have eaten at higher scale restaurants, they do ask that you put a deposit down. So we did have to make a $75 deposit to hold the table. And if you don't show up, you basically lose that table. So yes, of course, our reservation is at nine. So we do have to leave a couple of hours early. We gave us, I gave us an extra hour to leave because I know how slow she is. And then plus the traffic on 275 and 10 are probably gonna be bumper to bumper with it being Friday. A lot of people are probably traveling or maybe not since school has already started. So with all that out and that being said, let me go and find my purse. So YouTubers, I ended up having to drive. What? You guys see this? I told y'all she was gonna be late with this makeup. So I'll catch you guys at the restaurant. I'm not gonna be able to chat with you. So I'll chat with you later, peace. Those are too cute. And you didn't get me a pair? Really? Really? You normally be like, oh, she'll like these. You didn't even think about me. Girl, those are pretty. Yeah, we're at the H and it's pretty busy. I see a lot of people in. So we have reservations and Ready? I did. All my fingers recording. But eating her food, y'all. But she asking for. 
what deserves. Yes, yes, yes. So the night is finally over. This was more of a Mediterranean style restaurant slash club. The music was really nice. Um, it was very, really versatile. So yeah. So guys, if you want to check it out, check out the H in Orlando. I'm pretty sure you will like it. So guys, we're at the end of this vlog. If you have not yet subscribed to my channel, make sure you like, subscribe, and please don't forget to leave your comments down below. And until the next time, guys, I will catch you on the next go. Peace. Girl, I see your face everywhere. When I'm going out, you'll be there.